When a leaf falls from a tree, nature breaks down and regenerates its materials to use again. We've pioneered a revolutionary way to do the same with nylon, the Echinil Regeneration System. We make quality nylon yarn, Echinil, entirely from waste. The driving force behind this groundbreaking process is eco-visionary Giulio Bonazzi. But little did he know what he was letting himself in for. Uh, I compare what was the original idea. It's a, it's a totally different uh, world. Uh, we are uh, regenerating a different type of waste uh, in a totally different uh, way because uh, we vastly underestimated uh, the difficulty of this uh, journey. And I would say today, fortunately, because uh, if we had known everything, I don't know if uh, we would have started uh, this incredible uh, journey. You know? So, yes, uh, someone is saying uh, that I was uh, crazy. Maybe I was not crazy, simply I didn't know and uh, uh, I was lucky not to know. With Echinil, waste is not the end, but the beginning. We needed a reliable supply, but from where? We couldn't just call for a delivery. We had to invent an entire supply chain piece by piece, working backwards to create new systems and new partnerships. But with regard to post-consumer waste, we have two main streams. One which is coming from carpet recycling, and the second, but in terms of volume equally important, is coming from Fishnet. In this adventure, the collaboration with every possible partner is essential because nothing existed before, everything is to be invented specifically for this project. So you can imagine that we, ourselves, alone, impossible. So we really need cooperation from every possible corner. The old nets that we recover and regenerate come not only from fish farms or the fishing industry, but also from projects we have like Healthy Seas. In this journey from waste to wear, abandoned nets are recovered from the seas by volunteer divers and regenerated through our echinil process. Recovering these nets is complex and time-consuming, but very important, as each net could remain in the sea for 500 years, trapping and killing marine animals. The other stream is so-called carpet fluff. What is carpet fluff? Is a face fiber of post-consumer carpets that, at the end of their lives, are collected and separated in the different components and we recycle the so-called face fiber and this is our small gold mine where we drill our oil, you know. So I like to, uh, to give this image of this uh, uh, location because actually at the end of the day we avoid to drill oil and resources from our planet and so we really close the loop making a beautiful product. The Econeal Reclaiming Program now rescues thousands of tons of old carpet, industrial waste, and fishing nets each year. Armed with a waste supply, we had to invent our own process and machinery to regenerate nylon from it. The nylon is separated from the other waste, shredded and prepared. Then the alchemy begins. Our depolymerization plant breaks the nylon down into its building blocks. Because no quality is lost, we can polymerize it into new, high-grade nylon to spin into a range of yarns. Now, our fully operational industrial system recovers more high-performance nylon than ever thought possible, saving fossil fuels, cleaning up the oceans, giving new life to old waste, and halving CO2 emissions compared with nylon from oil. Econeal is 100% regenerated and 100% regenerable, infinitely. The end products? Beautiful carpets and lingerie, car interiors and clothing. The possibilities are endless as we look to the future. The 
it's very important to understand this point because today we are recycling products that may have five, ten, eight years of life. So that were designed, engineered a long time ago without the idea and the hope that at the end they will be recycled. You know, so it's something which is really very difficult for us. So. A point where we have to invest a lot together with our uh, clients and with our suppliers is to re-engineer today's products uh, into something that tomorrow is more easily recyclable or completely, hopefully, uh, recyclable. Because of course, uh, they, not the dream, but the target is really not to send anything to landfill and not to take anything from our planet. So this is a very important point. The Echineal Regeneration System, closing the loop 